All right, so here we are at the bench and had a question about an OP1 battery. Uh, the person needed help because they need to find a new aftermarket battery. So they wanted to make sure that they could find a battery that actually fit. Got my digital caliper here. And this is the original battery from the OP1. Get the thickness. 5.2 millimeters. So you got 5.2. 48.9. And 70.5. That's your OP1 battery dimensions. And of course the battery fits right in the slot right here. Right there, we've got 49.8, okay? 72.2. And then as far as the depth goes, looks like it's right at five. So now that we've got our battery dimensions, which will represent one of the numbers that we're looking for when we go shopping. And as you see here on this battery, it's going to be 50, 40, 70. I believe this battery will fit. And what that means is that it is 5.0 millimeters thick, 40 millimeters wide, and 70 millimeters long. All right, so now we're going to go over here to ifixit.com just to get the battery specs for your OP1. Right here in the middle under introduction, it tells you that your battery is an 1800 milliamp lithium polymer battery at 3.7 volts and so my recommendation is to go ahead and replace the one you've got with another 1800 milliamp hour there's no real reason to increase the size and when you change the size the battery indicator on the op1 no longer functions properly it does not appear so if you can find an 1800 milliamp hour battery in the right size, so we'll go over here to eBay. And basically the size that we've sort of decided on is going to be a 50, 40, 70, which means it's five millimeters tall, 40 millimeters wide and 70 millimeters long. So those numbers can be a little bit smaller than our measurements, but they cannot be bigger. But the problem is, once you go look for this battery and you find one over here on eBay, you're going to notice that your little clip is not present. So I have actually had a hard time finding one of these batteries that has the clip, so you don't have to fool with it. So in addition to finding the right battery, you're probably going to need to do a little homework on replacing this little clip right here. So what I'll do is I'll do another video, just like this one right here called how to change lipo connectors safely but i'll cover that in the next video so now that we figured out what battery we need then we can go ahead and order it and get on with the next step now if i discover that i can find a battery that has the correct clip i will let you know but so far it looks like you're going to have to buy one and install that clip yourself so anyway that's going to be it uh, that covers at least these dimensions and the specs of the OP1 battery. All right, that'll do it for me. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.